Hey guys, it's me Pia, and I'm going to be um, doing my makeup live because I want to show you guys step by step what I'm doing. Okay, so right now I got foundation underneath and on my chin, and then my upper lip. And so I, got, I already got my eyeshadow done, but I just want to talk to you guys for a little bit because I'm going to be going out um, to to shop. So, let me put you guys over here. I'm going to take off the charger. And then, put you guys over here with me. Okay. Anyway, I hope this is good. It's not a lot of lighting. So, we're just going to have to work with this right now. Okay. Now, you know what? i got to make things work for you guys. So I'm going to turn my ass around. I'm going to place you guys on my bed. Alright, there you go. Okay, so. Now we can work it out. Hold on. was super super loud I'm sorry you guys okay so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm still gonna blend my foundation in and I'm using my little makeup foundation brush that I got from Target so it's good for what it is I mean it's good you know I mean excuse what it is well I mean it's good for what it does to my face and it works well so, I don't want to wear a lot of makeup today, a lot of foundation. I mean, I usually break out a lot because, you know, I have to shave and I break out, you know, blackheads. My skin is not that, it's not perfect at all. I'm not going to, like, say that's, like, perfect. I mean, it looks perfect, yeah, because, you know, I'm not going to lie, I do airbrush a lot of my photos, you know. And there will be some of them where I, it's not like that I'm insecure about my photos or anything, or how I look, like, I can care less. But, you know, just makeup is a fun, a fun, like thing you can do when you just want to make your confidence more better and like just to boost it up a little bit your self esteem but hey if you if you don't wear makeup and you have a good um, high self esteem good for you but if you like adding a little bit of makeup and want to be glam oh well so be it have fun you know I mean, I'm not the type of girl that will be putting on makeup every day. You know, sometimes I really don't need it, but then I just feel that and it has nothing to do with being transgendered and being clockable or whatever. I mean, whatever, I don't care. I'm open to anything, you know. I don't, I'm not going to just be like that. I'm like making no sense, but oh well, I'm trying to like do this really fast. But, okay, anyway. What I was trying to say, and then let me redo that because that was important to what I did say. Like, me being like a transgender and everything, like, I sort of, I don't really care if I get clocked or not because I'm living my life. I'm having a good time. I can care less what other people think of me, whether if it's boy or girl. I don't care. You know, I just have, I just live my life each day by day. And I just keep going, you know, I don't worry about what, what people are saying, you know, if you keep worrying about what people are saying, you're not going to get nowhere, you're just going to keep letting them get you down, and then you're going to be this, like, worrying about everything, and that used to be me, it really did, but until I had, I built a very, a very, very strong, conf confident mind in myself, because if I just kept worrying about what people are saying, then I'm just going to be like, yeah, I'm just going to be letting everything get to me, and I can't do that, you know, I'm a strong person, I'm a strong individual, and I will go out there and be proud of who I am and just rock whatever style I'm rocking. You know what I mean? You can't do that. You can't just sit around and then just let everyone talk about you and then, like, stop you from doing what you want to do. You know, you just can't do that. So I don't let that stop me. You know, whether if I get clocked or not, it don't matter. Oh, well, at least I rock the style I, I did. It don't matter. You know, boy, girl, lesbian, uh, transgender, gay, don't matter. Rock whatever you want to rock. It's awesome to be whoever you want to be. So, and me as a transgender woman, I'm living as a woman. So, I'm going to go out as a woman and be happy and be free and love myself and love everyone around me and have a good time. That's just me.
So now what we're gonna do is blend the shadows. I mean shadows, I meant um, the foundation with my, um, I need again. Well, let me see how this looks first. I make mean, a see from the webcam, but not really that perfect from the webcam. So, oh shit, I need to add some more. I'm telling you guys, this camera makes it look like it's all perfect, but not really. But I'm, I'm really glad I'm opening up to you guys a lot about personal lives and personal things that go on, you know? Um, like my lifestyle and stuff, because I don't really talk about it. I just live my life, you know? But it, you know, if I don't talk about things that are actually really going on, and how am I going to help people out, you know? And I want to help a lot of people out and build that self-esteem, that confidence, and that level of not worrying about what you look like or how you are and whatnot. Just be whoever you want to be, you know, but always stay true to yourself, you know? And I have changed a lot during my lifetime of becoming this beautiful woman I am today. You know, I have. You know, I really have. And I'm very proud of how far I came. So, and you can do it too. It just takes that confidence, that level to not care about what people think and just rock whatever lifestyle you are rocking and don't worry about people. You know, there's so many judgmental people out there. It's going to happen. It's going to happen no matter what. You're not going to meet nice people every single day. And I counter, I do, I do counter a lot of nice people, but the majority are really mean. They're judgmental, you know, and me. I, I, I do, like I said, I do have a disability and, you know, I have to look at that as well and still work my lifestyle, but I don't worry about all that because I'm just a normal person living life, living life at, at, you know, with a different type of lifestyle, but hey, I'm a human being. I'm doing what I can, living it up, I'm not worried about anything, and that's just me, you know? So, I do get a lot of um, messages of, like, you know, rude, mean comments, like, you're just a tranny, you're a faggot, blah, 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 you're so this, you're so that, it's like, please, I heard worse, I live my life, if it's hurting you that much, don't watch my shit, don't watch my videos, don't watch nothing in mine, I'm having a good time, you know? If you, if you have to insult someone and make yourself feel better, if, if that's going to get you going and having a good day, good for you, you know? But still, it only makes you look twice as bad, you know, because honestly, you ain't hurting me. No one hurts me at all. Comments, they don't, yeah. Uh-uh. So that's pretty good almost. But you know what? I'm going to start making some more personal videos because I feel that a lot of this self-confidence I have, I need to share with others because I do have, and I do have my ups and downs, you know, I'm not going to lie, I am human. I do have ups and downs. I do have points where I feel like things do get to me and, but like my mom always taught me, you have to look above everything and just keep being yourself and you can't let negative negativity get to you because if you do, you're going to be a failure. So I can't do that. You know, I have to keep my confidence up every damn time and not worry about things like that. So, yes. I think that's pretty much blended out. Let me see. My sister actually um, looked at my face one time, right? And I did my makeup so good, like it was blended. She's like, girl, did you airbrush your face? I'm like, no and this is in person too i'm like did you ever she's like did you ever your face i'm like no not at all and she's like you did your makeup really good i'm like oh thank you but it's good that when you're really good with makeup you just got to keep doing it and doing it and practice makes perfect you know so i did that and again i'm still learning day by day you know i'm not the perfect um master of blending but I do what I do and it rocks it out so let's see make sure you get your chin too and your neck and everything like that and just have a good time you know